Ray Looney. We are your babysitters. Yeah. You got a baby? We'll sit on it. My name is Richard Babysitter, and this is Sir Adrian Babysitter. Ha ha! Babysitters! <laughs> is that okay? Uh, yes, that's okay then. But uh, there must be some mistake. We booked somebody called uh, Jennifer. That's us, matey. We are Jennifer. Our trading name. Uh, excuse me a moment. Darling, darling. Oh, what now? Oh, no, it isn't, darling, darling. There's a couple of psychotics outside claiming to be babysitters. Let him, darling. They can look after Rosemary. Well, dear, yeah, darling. That's a television. I'd rather you didn't watch it at all or listen to any records. Right. We'll be back about midnight. Have fun and please try not to make a mess. Whoa, another saucy babysitter. <laughs> to make a mess. Uh. <coughs> How are we doing? Another four hours to go. <sighs> oh, God, I can't stop. <laughs> Don't touch the furniture. Remember what we said? We're going to earn some proper money for a change. Proper legal money. Naturally. 
I'll eat that when I've peeled it. There you go, sweetheart. Aha! Uh -huh. Thank you, Ducky. Ah. This is the life. Someone says, Oh, Roger, why don't we take this expensive vase of flowers and place it over here on the coffee table? <laughs> See, they're going to spot it then, aren't they? Yes, they are. Yes. There's only one thing for it. We'll have to blind everyone that comes into the house. Yes. Or option two... We could replace the pane of glass from the coffee table with a pane of glass from elsewhere. Perhaps a window. I can see your point. Can you? Oh, sorry. So correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> what you're suggesting is that we take a pane of glass from the window and place it on top of the coffee table. Correct. Brilliant. <laughs> Just went up in my anger. 